Hello, my lovelies. My name is Jenny and welcome to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be talking about a box that I have been waiting on since March. March, my lovelies, March. And that is the Macy's Beauty Box. I signed up for this box back in March after I saw Chrissy Harless do this box. She does all unboxings, guys. You guys gotta go follow her. She's freaking amazing. But I saw her unbox this, and this is right around the time I was getting into into boxes. I, I got my first boxy charm in February, and then I got hooked. I was like, "Ooh, I gotta see these boxes all about." And if you haven't been here before, guys, consider subscribing and becoming one of my lovelies because I do lots of unboxings. At one time, I used to have 17 boxes. Now I'm like to seven or maybe eight or nine. I don't know. I just got a couple more. But I love doing subscription boxes because it's like Christmas every day because. When you get boxes in, sometimes you know what you're getting. Like with my Ipsy, I know what I'm getting. With BoxyCharm, you know sometimes and sometimes you don't. There's always things thrown in. I used to get Play by Sephora, but they canceled that one. So I got this one because I knew it was similar to that one. But then the country shut down because of COVID. So I signed up for it and then I was getting billed for it. But the billing wasn't going through because they suspended the box. Well, then I got an email about three weeks ago that said your um, subscription to Macy's Beauty Box has been refunded. And I'm like, what do you mean refunded? I haven't gotten it. So I was really confused. So I went to my Macy's account and I saw where they processed the box, but it hadn't been shipped or anything like that. And then I went to my bank account and I saw where they deducted it, but then they refunded it. And then I went back and like, I don't know, I, my email maybe like three hours later saw where it shipped. So I was really confused. So I went back to my Macy's account and it showed that it was shipped. So I guess they refunded my account because of delay with the shipment because I never got my first box. So I'm assuming they just credited my account because of all the hassle. I never got anything about it. I never got an email saying, we're sorry for the delay, but you're finally going to get your box again nothing i never again but for me it'd be the first time i never got anything so i'm not really sure what the whole thing was on that but needless to say unless they charge me again i never went back and looked after that because i was just like you know one of those uh okay never i never checked it out but the box is 15 dollars and you pay tax on it there's no shipping or anything like that so we're just gonna look because obviously i have not opened it it's it's in a box I don't know anything about it, like nothing, because I don't know if they've made any changes to it. I don't know what they've done. And I just got finished filming this eye look. Um, I don't know which video is going to go on first. This is very different for me, and my glasses are hella dirty here. But anyway, um, I did a really dark look because it's October Halloween and all that good stuff. You know, I, I despise Halloween because my dad was a homicide detective when I was a little girl, and I got a. He worked like investigating the mafia and stuff when I was in Baltimore. So I got. I got a, um, oh cool, it just opens up like this. I got a, um, razor blade and an apple when I was a little girl, so I hated the Halloween ever after that. So yeah, that, that was what happened to me. Anyway, so, it is, oh, I hurt my back. You get a bag, okay, cute, 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 cute. So we're going to look. At that and then you have a card and the card says open have fun repeat your monthly beauty fix is here we've chosen the top brands and essential items the beauty obsessed can't live without try them now love them forever okay and it looks like we have a full bag of Joe Malone London it says treat yourself there's a $5 coupon um, your next beauty purchase valid in store online 925 to 1127 and it is like my own code so I'm not going to be able to share that because I think it's just based on on my box um, all right so it is a $90 value it says Joe Malone London in his in this first ever collab Macy's brings you a special exclusive beauty box loaded with Joe Malone go go goodie goodies. Joe Malone is a very expensive cologne brand and I've gotten one thing from Joe Malone in a Sephora box once and it was a, just a little tiny perfume sample and I gave that to my husband because I thought it was very masculine smelling so I'm not sure what these are going to smell like but there are 
um, it tells you everything about them. But this is the bag. It's it's uh, like a shiny, and it has the little Joe Malone label on it right there. If you can see that, it's gonna want to focus on my face. So let me see if I can do this. Here we go. And there's no smell to it, which is a good thing. It's got um, the Joe Malone or Made in China label on the inside. It's um, that on the inside. It's got one of the little silica packs. And if you guys don't know, these are good to, like if you're going anywhere like on a trip and you don't want anything to get wet, like your beach towels, your beach bags, anything like that, you can actually put these in there and it actually keeps things from getting too moist. Just to let you know that. That's a really cute little bag. I like the little square bags because it makes it easier than the round bags to store things in. Okay. So the first thing it says, I like the fact that they have it bagged up like this. I think that's cool. So we're going to look at this one first. Let's see what it is. It's like unwrapping cookie sticks. All right. It's a little candle, a little votive, and it is nectarine, blossom, and honey scented candle. Okay. And this is worth, the full size is worth $69. It says, after lighting the first time, let the entire top layer wax melt before extinguishing to help its longevity. And I really don't smell anything. It's cute. I just don't, I don't smell anything. I don't know whether it just has to be lit for me to smell it or not. There it is. Right there. Cute. I like little votives. Okay. Now we're going to open the rest of it here. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Boo. Okay. It was funny at the time. All right. So we're just going to get on the list here. It says wood, sage, and sea salt body cream. And it's this little container right here. It's that big right there. It is $86 value for the full size, and this one is actually 0.5 ounces. It says, it's, um, it's an energizing scent, it says. Let me see. Yeah, it smells pretty good. All right, we're going to take a little test of this and see what it smells like on the skin, or my skin at least. Everybody has their own scent. Um, it smells different on the skin, but yeah, it smells really good. I like that. It smells good. Okay. And if you have never been here before, what I do is if I get something that does not work for me, I put it in an end of month giveaway that I do every single month. And it runs the last Saturday of the month and it goes to the first Saturday of the following month. All right. The next thing is English pear and freesia cologne. And that's this one right here. And I am a perfume nut and a jewelry nut. I have probably 500 pair of earrings and so many, so many perfumes. I just, I love them. And the full size of this is $142. This is colognes have lighter concentration than eau de toilettes. All right. So what I'm going to do, instead of spraying on myself, I'm going to spray it on the tissue paper. Of course, it's going to have a different smell than what it would if it was on the skin, but... I don't want to spray it in the air and I don't want to spray it on myself just in case I don't like it because certain smells will give me migraines and I don't want to chance it. Okay, I love the smell of freesia. So we'll see what it smells like in the actual perfume. It says, channeling the essence of fall. This is the scent to wear when reminiscing about the cooler days. Amber Patchouli Notes, a relaxing edition. Oh, I like that. I think I'm going to like that one. Yeah, I do. I like that one. Okay. The next thing we have is Peony and Blush Suede Cologne. It says a perfect balance of charming and flirty. This floral blend is classically fem feminine. Notes of red apple and jasmine dial up this delectability. And again, 142. Okay. I wish you could smell it, like scratch and scent. That'd be good. I wish, I wish I could like go and have you all smell it. Cause then this, you know, would make so much more sense. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, that smells really good. Oh. All right, that smells really good. I like that one a lot. Okay, the next thing we have is, okay, this one's a hand, hand wash. It is lime, basil, and mandarin hand and body wash. And did I show it's the same? It looks the same. This is what the body wash looks like. And this is $44, it says. It says it conditions and nourishes the skin. It says said, this, this blend of notes is the luxury brand's signature scent. And I can't get it open. <laughs> Probably from that lotion I thought it went. No, it's not smart to do, Jen. Let's see if I can figure out. Oh, there it went. I opened it. Okay. And it does have a seal on the top. I oh, know it wasn't sealed, it was just laying there. Okay. That smells really good too. I like that. I like anything that's kind of like a lime and basil kind of scent. I like that. Okay. And the last thing we have is the Blackberry and Bay Cologne. And it's just one of the little, you know, card that you get as a sample when you buy something at like Sephora or someplace like that or Macy's, for instance. But it's a good size one. It's not one of the little small ones. It's, you know, it's a decent size one. And we're going to put that on another piece because I want to... Not right there. Right. This looks like the same one that I gave my husband. It says, um, Childhood Memories of Blackberry Picking, Fruity. So it's Blackberry Bay. $142 again. It's expensive. I don't pay that much for mine. I buy mine on perfumes.net, I think it is. That's where I get all my colognes and stuff from. Yeah, that's definitely not me. It's too fruity. It's like, um, yeah, like blackberries. He might like that one, or my son might like that one, but that one I don't like too much. It's just, I don't, I don't like blackberries. I just don't, don't like that one. All right, so that one I don't like. If they don't like that one, um, then that one will be in a giveaway. I like the other ones, though. I'm actually going to put one on now because I did not put my perfume on this morning. I'm a big, huge fan of Gucci Bloom. That's like my favorite, favorite. But I'm going to try this peony and blush. And I want to see what it smells like on my skin itself. Yeah, it smells really good. I love peonies. My mother had peonies. Peony bushes. At, her, at the house when I was growing up. It smelled so good. Okay. So this is what the picture looks like that's on the inside. So it shows you like what the actual full sizes would look like. Um, now, as far as do I like it. So we got that little sample, that little tiny sample. And then we got these little samples, the little body wash, and then the lotion, and then the little, the little candle for $15. Um, Eh, um, I would rather have beauty items, but I like fragrance. Like I said, I'm a huge fragrance fan, and I love lotions and candles. So that's right up my alley. So yeah, I like it. I do. Um, I'm hoping that in the future, like I'm hoping next month's box will have some some beauty items in it. Um, I think this is a good pick me up right now because of everything that's been going on. So I like it personally. I know a lot of my viewers out there though would rather have makeup items and some of you would rather have skincare items. So a lot of you are very sensitive to smells. So no, a lot of you will not like this kind of thing, but this is not something I think they normally do. I think this is just one of those things. So I'm hoping that moving forward, it's not going to be a brand thing that they do every month, but I don't know. This is my first time getting this box and I don't think that's normal for them because I've watched other boxes in the past and I've never seen them do this. So I don't know, but I do like the fact that they all fit this little right here so you can take it with you when you go. But the flowers off I like because when I do buy something from them, which I don't buy from Macy's very often, but I have before. I've bought um, my MAC cosmetics. When I buy MAC, I do buy it from Macy's. So I can use it for that. So yeah, yeah, I'm glad I got it though because I've been waiting for it since March and it's only 15 bucks. So, you know, that took place of my other Ipsy bag that I got rid of because I got rid of my $12 Ipsy bag. So that took place of that. So oh, there we go. Yeah, so I'm, I'm glad I finally got it. 
and I love the smell. It smells really good. And I got new perfumes to try because I go through so many perfumes. I have so many perfumes and the only ones I ever really use out of is like my Gucci Bloom. And like I said, I got that at perfumes.net and I got a big one. It's, I mean, you can't see it. it's behind the elephants over there. But I mean, I got a big one for like $60 because I am not paying $100 for no perfumes. Don't. I'm the bargain hunter. Look for bargain. Ask me. Ask me the sites. I hook you up. And I buy stuff from Rakuten. Rakuten. <laughs> Missy Slaughter. She told me how to say it right. So if you're watching Missy, Rakuten, Rakuten, Rakuten. That's that's where you kind of go through to get it. Macy's is on there, I think. I think. So I will leave the link below for you to sign up for this box. And I don't know whether I get anything for it. I don't think so. I don't think it's any kind of, you know, points or anything. I don't know if they do that or not. They might. So they maybe they do. So I, they may. They may not. I don't know. But I'll throw that link down there. Anyway, guys, thank you. Thank you for being here with me today. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. I say it all the time, but I truly mean it. I really, really do. This channel means the world to me, and I'm so glad that you took some time out of your day to spend with me. And if you think that you would like this box, then go subscribe to it and give it a shot. And if you don't like it, you can always cancel. If you don't like it, don't go get it. Go maybe check out some of the other unboxings I do and give me your opinion. But let me know what you think. If you... If you uh, think it's eh, you know, let, just let me know what your opinion is. Anyway, I gotta go. I gotta go film my Ipsy unboxing. I'm excited about this. I got some good stuff because, you know, I already know what I'm getting. So, and I got some good stuff. And I've already used a couple things because I already knew what I was getting. So I already opened it. I cheated on that one. And I'll tell you in the video. Anyway, guys, I love you so, so much. Thank you for spending time with me today. I already said it. I'm saying it again subscribe, hit the bell notification, come back and see me again. Take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Be good to yourself. Be good to each other and stay safe. Love you guys. Bye.